So let's talk earthquake safety, boys and girls. What do you do if you're inside for an earthquake? Well, first of all, recognize that all it is is the planet releasing some energy. People got a burp, so do the planets. Planet Earth has to burp every now and then and release some energy. And that's all an earthquake is. But what do you do if you feel that rumbling and waving and rocking and rolling? You duck and cover. If you can get under a table, get under a table. Cover your head, cover your neck, cover the back of your neck, cover your head and duck down. What if you're not near a table though? You get in a doorway and still cover your head, cover your neck and duck down. But what if you're outside and there's nothing around to get under? Duck down, cover your head, cover your neck, okay? You should also have an earthquake kit in your house. Should be full of food and water to last you five days. How many days? Five days. It should also have medicine and first aid stuff because sometimes people can get hurt from earthquakes. It happens. And sometimes those injuries might be needing a Band-Aid or bigger than a Band-Aid. And it might be a while before you can get to a hospital. So you just want to be prepared. Food and water for five days. Medicine and first aid also for five days. Clothes if you can. Shoes. Good walking shoes. Good shoes. Shoes that won't hurt your feet and shoes that will keep you from getting hurt while walking. That's a di there's a there's a difference. So just stay safe and don't panic because all an earthquake is is planet Earth needs to burp. Okay?